Hi and welcome to the tutorial for the new Jabun Resume Search Tool. In this tutorial, we will go through the tool's functionality, how to access it, how to do a search and optimize your results, how to add an applicant's profile to your resume bank, and finally, how to access a complete applicant's profile information, download their CV, and associate them to a job offer. Jabun Resume Search is a complementary tool for your active job offers. It allows you to search among applicants already registered in Jaboom for talent that corresponds to your needs. This tool uses credits that give you the right to access the same amount of resumes. Your credits will be consumed only when you open a profile that you're interested in. Once an applicant's profile is open, it will be added to your resume bank and will be available at any time in your Jaboom account. You can access this tool by clicking on the Resume Search button present on your online job postings and the job offers per unposted under 30 days. The complimentary tool is also available while consulting the details of your online job offer by clicking on the fourth tab titled Resume Search. As you can see, this tool not only allows you to search among the profiles and resumes of all the public candidates registered in Jabboom, but also amongst those in your own resume bank, as well as amongst resumes associated to a job posting. A search on your resume bank will include every application received from all the job offers posted from your account, as well as previously opened profiles. A search on resumes associated to a specific job posting will allow you to select one of the job offers that has been posted in your account, whether it's still active or not, and search through the applications received for that particular offer. To do a search, you simply need to enter the keywords that correspond to your requirements. Your keywords could be a job title, a specific diploma or certification, or even a specific skill set. The location is automatically filled with a postal code indicated in your job offer, but you can change it for another postal code, a city, a region, or leave it empty. The resume search tool will then search for corresponding matches among applicants' profile, including their work experience, the content of the resumes, their location, and the job room categories that the applicants have selected. The search results will be automatically sorted by relevance, but it's also possible to sort them by the most recently updated profiles or by proximity. By using the menu on the left side of the page, you can also choose a range of proximity from the selected location. You can filter the results by job sector and specify the years of experience you expect. You can filter by the language you need the candidates to speak and by the level of education that you require. If you want to make sure that your search has more details, you can always add additional keywords to the search criteria or conduct a new search without leaving the page. The candidates corresponding to your search will be presented to you in a list, showing the corresponding keywords you specified highlighted in bold characters. The title of the candidate's most recent job position, along with the name of the employer and the duration of employment, will introduce each candidate. You will also be able to see the candidate's previous work experience, followed by the job sector or sectors in which the applicant worked with the duration of employment. The level of education, spoken languages, as well as the region where the candidate lives are also indicated, as distance between the candidates and the job offer's location will be indicated next to the region when you make a search with a location. An extract of the candidate's resume where the keywords were found, the date of the latest profile update, and the type of work permit that the candidate possesses will also be displayed to complete the profile presentation. When a profile shown in search results is already a part of your resume bank, whether you have previously opened it or the candidate has already applied to one of your job offers, the candidate will be introduced by their full name, which will give you automatically access to their profile by a simple click. You will also have the option to qualify them for the job offer, share their profile with a colleague, or download the resume all directly from this page. The lock icon at the left of a profile indicates that the candidate is not yet on your resume bank, so you do not have access to the candidate's complete information. When a profile interests you, you need only to click on Open. Only then one credit will be consumed and the profile and resume of the candidate will be automatically added to your resume bank. The lock icon will then disappear and be replaced by the candidate's full name. By clicking on the candidate's name, you will be able to consult their full profile, visualize their resume and access their contact information. 
From there, you will be able to associate the candidate to the job offer by qualifying it into one of the managing application lists or even associate it to another job offer for which the candidate would be better qualified. Once a candidate's profile is associated to a job posting, it will be distinguished from the applicants on your list by a tag. You can also choose to reject the applicant, add a note to the candidate's profile, download the resume, or share the profile with a colleague or colleagues you choose to share it with. Once you've finished consulting a profile, you can return to the search results to keep looking for more candidates, conduct a new search, or start managing your job applications. You are now ready to look for the talents that suit you. Thank you for watching this tutorial for Jumboom's resume search tool and see you soon!